Two people have steel pipes inserted into their bellies, but a woman doesn't care. Instead, she asks the doctor if there's any chewing gum. Excuse me? Does anybody have a breath mint? Everyone was bewildered. This was a matter of life and death, yet you're worried about bad breath. It might leave a bad impression on the other person. The paramedic at the scene explained, These two individuals don't even know each other. They just happened to be sitting next to each other on the subway. It was only at the moment of the subway accident that they were impaled together by the steel pipes. However, as everyone stared at the images on the wall, they all fell into contemplation. The steel pipes happened to block the wounds of both individuals, thus preventing severe bleeding. Now, to save them, the first step is to get them off the steel pipes. But the key issue is, no matter which way the pipes are moved, the person being moved will bleed to death on the spot. Who lives and who dies is solely at the discretion of the doctor. After a comprehensive comparison, everyone agreed to move the more severely injured girl. Because she had lost feeling below her waist, the boy had a greater chance of survival, as he could move freely on his feet. But when the doctor finally informed the two of the final decision, the man insisted on sacrificing himself. No. No. Anybody? 